It's the last time I let somebody steal my peace If you ain't adding to the place, shawty, you can't eat Don't be acting like you know me, bro, we don't speak A lot of people come and go, but it won't be me You can't break me, I just take control of the environment Get them worked up and then I put them in retirement I won't lose sleep if you don't have my back But don't you try to front on me, cause you can't take that back I'm still God's shot, regardless if they like it or not I've been busting out the seams, I don't fit in a box Cutting people out the picture, yeah, you might get cropped And I don't carry dead weight, so you gon' get dropped Bringing it back to perspective, I've been so reflective Had to guard my energy and now I'm so protective I don't waste time trying to prove myself I can't please you so much that I lose myself I think it's way past time I remove myself I done tried everything, it's time to choose myself And I don't need your cosign God did it when he threw another lifeline Yeah, you know it's my time I don't need better, I just get better Scorpios, what it do, what the business is Hey y'all, how y'all doing? This is 1028 Awakenings, and I'm back again with another motherfucking video. All right, we're doing a love read. All right, what's going on with my Scorpios in their love life? Single, non-single, mingle, mingle, dingle, married, relationships. Y'all know how they go. All right, so Scorpio, ooh, time for friends. Okay, friends, introduce you to new friends. So Scorpio, you could be going out and somebody be like, this is my friend, Scorpio. You like, hey, I don't really want to be here. Okay, so Scorpio, you could be forced to go out or forced to do something. Spirit is telling you, take your ass outside, okay? Spend some time with your friends because they're going to introduce you to a new love, okay? So Scorpio, you could be out with your people, your posse, your team, and somebody could be like, damn, I'm glad I came. You kind of fine, okay? So you're going to be introduced scorpio to somebody new when you kicking it with your friends that's beautiful all right scorpios all right so there's going to be a lot of passion okay but you could keep it in your mind but it is going to be mutual that's nice all right it says faith and destiny so whoever this is they don't believe in like faith i mean they have faith but they don't believe in timing and destiny and everyone is supposed to meet whoever this is is a very much so like not atheist person but they don't believe in luck that's not good but you do got a lot of passion for this motherfucker and you do like this person somebody here could be extremely long somebody also could have a short haircut all right but with faith and destiny here somebody just feels like they time with you could be up this could be somebody totally different spirit just said all right so you could meet somebody with your friends and there's a lot of passion on both sides but y'all both hold it in but your actions speak louder than words you also have faith and destiny things will work out in the end in reverse so somebody just feels like their chapter with you has closed scorpio they feel like you know it, it's just not gonna work out it's it's a dead horse and it, it just ain't working okay oh damn we got the divine feminine so whoever the fuck this is this is somebody who's loving caring nourishing uh kind like you know when you around them you just feel healed you know you feel safe you feel protected some women are like that they carry this energy um of just being you know taken care of it's not like they're taking care of you but they hold you a certain way they love you a certain way they kiss you a, a certain way and it just makes you feel like you're safe you're stable and you're okay it's like what your mama do it you be like oh you know my mama got this robe i smell like oh that's my mom you know what I'm saying? It's like it's like that, okay? But somebody feels like they fucked it up with the divine feminine. Shit, they fucked it up with this pure creature. <laughs> okay. I don't know who the fuck this is, but yeah, they just lost faith in this situation. They feel like they fucked it up with this person. Oh, okay. So you got to be careful with this new friend. It's a lot of lust, okay? The lust is going down, so there is a lot of passion. So y'all will have intellectual things to talk about, Scorpio. So this is really good. With lust going downward, there is going to be a hot, passionate situation, but there is going to be intellect. There is going to be conversation, and there could be some dating, okay? There is some dating here, all right? Because they kissing and shit. Somebody also could have dreads okay this bitch got dreads like look how long that shit is okay so there's a lot of lust here somebody is losing a lot of lust and having a lot of passion for you as well okay Ooh, hurt feelings okay so somebody who is very lustful for you um their hurt feelings are moving away okay this could be very somebody that's calculated and tactic with lux lust here and ego some niggas be like oh you don't want to fuck me so you don't like me but it's crazy that people be offering their dick and their vagina before they even know your last name like what the fuck is going on i mean i don't understand how you would fuck somebody and then when if they ask you for their your car no you like bitch i never do some shit like that but but you're giving out your dick you know you're giving out your vagina okay I I said vagina but you know why would you freely give these things but you don't even know anything intellectually about this person you don't know how they live how they pay their bills you got to be very careful with that i mean some dudes be getting so mad because you don't want to have sex with them but they not mad that you don't want to get to know them they like you don't need to know me you just need to have sex with me that is nasty y'all need to make sure y'all spiritual hygiene is up do not just lay with people you don't know and people will quickly lay with people i'm not judging you guys but damn get to know a motherfucker 
Stop being so quick to lay and hop. Like, that shit is weird, y'all, for real. Okay, so this divine feminine is very wealthy. Okay, they could be a life path eight. I'm just saying. <laughs> anyway, but for real, this person don't have no money issues. Money is coming in on time and on schedule, baby. Okay, um, somebody really wants to overcome the odds with you. They're like, man, we got off at the wrong start. Can we restart again? All right. So Scorpio, just know if you are the divine feminine all right if you are this loving beautiful creation of a creature who has you know the life pattern here which is also right here i'm just saying you ain't gonna have no money issues if your money was tight that shit gonna be flowing out so don't you worry about it you could be seeing 888 eight, eight like a motherfucker all right so let's get some confessions because we got hurt words here so somebody says some shit and they really bother somebody's ego what was these hurt words about for my scorpios Ooh, it says the karmic i chose over you ran through ran through the ran me through the dirt okay so scorpio this person could have chose many other things other than a bitch over you okay or this motherfucker is single whether she be um a female or a male but you know they chose somebody that they knew longer this wasn't no karmic i mean it wasn't doing well there's a lot of arguing but sometimes when you're dealing with old people you just feel like you owe them that loyalty you know what i'm saying and that's what was happening with this it says i didn't know i had a soul connection with you but somebody just feel like you know they can't get you out of their system they don't know what you're doing to them but they just feel like they love you they think about you and it's too soon to be saying they love you but they do feel like you're deeply in their mind you deeply in their soul they think about you they watching you they stalking you they they doing all of this stuff you know what i'm saying and they don't really know why you know they really do feel connected to you scorpio and 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 they did some hurtful shit or they moved some hurtful way and they really want to fix that shit they really want to fix how they keep coming at you with all this lust because all this lust is actually turning into passion and you could have met this person when you was out with friends all right that one is kind of deep all right, the internet has a lot to do with this connection globally. Y'all could be watching each other, not watching each other, secretly watching each other. Whatever this is, this has something to do with the number 31. And somebody could be world renowned, okay? And that could scare somebody. You know, when you're dealing with somebody that's the big shot, that shit is fearful. You know what? I'm going to be real with you guys. Two times, I'm going to say these little two stories. One time, I was fucking with this nigga. This nigga, everybody know this nigga, but I don't know this nigga because I don't know sports, okay? We met in the elevator. I told my followers this one time. Um and i was just talking to the nigga like regular he was like damn you cute you got hair i'm like bitch i do got hair so i took my little bond off because it was my birthday and you know once i found out who this person was i couldn't even talk to this person because he just made so much money he was actually um younger than me and i just felt intimidated by his success so i stopped fucking with him most girls would have jumped on that nigga in a heartbeat okay but that's just not me. And I just want you to know that sometimes when the universe upgrades, you gives you something better, you know, you just feel like, nah, I'm going to turn that down because it's just better than me, you know, and I'm not really there. Don't do that shit. I really wasn't attracted to him like that to be long term. But at the same time, you know, when God gives you something that matches your vibrational frequency, which is abundance, success, love, unconditional acceptance, be welcome to it. Don't be so welcome to some bullshit, some lying inconsistency and somebody who just a flake and bait. Love y'all high valued woman a feminine woman that's the greatest quality you're gonna find within a woman right because a woman that is truly tapped into her feminine nature is a nurturer mm. she is a healer when she has that healing and that nurturing and not only that she is a multiplier mm. meaning that anything that you give her she will help you multiply today's women are takers right they just want to receive they don't know how to take what is given to them and help multiply it think about what a woman has that a man doesn't have and that's a womb what we give her, she takes that within her womb, and she got that big womb energy, she gonna multiply, mm -hmm. right? She's going to produce. Your job is to give her something healthy to produce. A man has a vision, a woman helps produce that vision into reality.